What's that now? Don't like the cold? Can't stay in today. We have a ritual to perform, you and I. your name, girl. But will the goddess speak it back? <laughs> Normally it would be the mother who declares, if you had one. The whole village would attend. And matriarchs perform the ritual, but we are outcasts. Even so, we keep the tribe's rituals. Otherwise, we might become like the faithless old ones who turned their backs on the goddess. But their wickedness doomed them. To us, we're left the splendors of creation. Beasts of air, water, earth. And steel. It is one thing to hunt a beast, another to hunt a machine. You must be humble and respect their power. I will teach you this, one day. No, 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 off your knees. It's nearly time. And yes, you may speak to me. You came to bless the naming. Have not six months gone by since we entrusted her to you. But we are outcasts. You by choice. And she, well... I am a high matriarch, Rost. I bless whom I choose. Then you honor us. Yes, yes, now go and be ready to declare. Go! Oh, mother, this child needs a name by which to know her. That your love may warm her life as the rising sun warms all the earth. Speak her name! <laughs> and so her name is blessed. Stop this at once! What have you done? I've blessed the naming of a child. Stubborn woman, you call that curse a child? What did she tell you about his birth outcast? Answer! I've done only what you asked. To raise it, yes. We said nothing of love. Enough! And you, blessing its name like it was one I of the I know my duty to the them. Tribe. And to you. Without consultation. I'm here. And wherever you go, I will follow.
That's a lot of berries. You're quite the gatherer, aren't you, little bast? Now go and see if you can find some more, hmm? Well done, that's a good boy. Children, come with me. She's an outcast to be shunned. There. Oh, come on. get through. must be a ruin of the metal world. One of the old places. Ross said never go in places like this. But I have to find a way out. shot Lights everywhere. How does it do this? A metal door closed. Maybe this device I found can help. More lights, a shape. Connected to the door somehow. He changed color. It's 
door changed color too. It did it. love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but we can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Show me. Show me again. I can do. He's right behind you. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Look, Daddy can't be there with you and Mom, but... We can still have a party, right? <laughs> sure we can. <laughs> Happy birthday, Isaac. Daddy sure does love his little big man. Here. What happened to them? Such places are forbidden, Aloy. I fell in. They are of the metal world. What is that on your face? Nothing. Did you find it down there? No. Give it to me. No. Aloy, such things are dangerous. No! Sneaking away from home, you'll need to know how to survive in the wild. Come, Aloy. Home now. But starting tomorrow, you will learn to hunt. to that plaything. We descend to the valley now. Follow. The wilds can be dangerous, Aloy. You will need to stay close and do as I say. I know. Now. You're still scratched up from that fall you took yesterday. So let's start there. Take this medicine pouch. I'll show you how to fill it. See this plant over here? It's called salve brush. Come, gather its berries in your pouch. Good. Now eat the berries. They may taste bitter, but they can save your life. Always keep your pouch full of medicinal berries, flowers, and plants. Where are we? This valley is just a part of all Mother's embrace. Embrace. 
The Nor tribe watches these lands and keeps out the most dangerous machines, usually. Further down river, we'll find a herd of machines, and I will teach you how to hunt. Are they dangerous? All machines are dangerous, Aloy. Their power must be respected. But I will be beside you. Hmm. Aloy, a machine is coming. Crouch and follow me into the tall grass. There. Now stay low. Little one. No, Aloy. Such machines are called watchers. You must learn to avoid their gaze. If you are to survive in the wilds, I will show you. Listen close and do as I do. Stay still. Wait for it to pass. Now keep low and follow me across the trail to that tall grass. Another one. Let it pass. Come, back this way. The slower you move, the quieter you'll be. And crouched walking is quieter than upright. Wait for it. That's the last of them. Let's move on. You did well. They didn't see or hear you. Now stay close. That herd should be just ahead. Ignore him. But why is he up there? He's smiling at us. Tab! Get back where you belong! Tab! Where are you? Ignore him. We are outcasts and he is of the tribe. Maybe he doesn't like the tribe. Then he is a fool. Come now. Let's find that herd. Follow. There. See them? These are called striders. You chase them off. <sighs> to show you how some machines startle easily if they detect you and run away. They're approached by stealth. Don't worry. We'll catch up with them further down the valley. You'll see. Now, I want you to find some rocks that fit the cup of your hand. Why? Do as I say, Aloy, and gather the rocks. I will show you how to use them. Those will do. Follow.
Aloy, over here. There's the herd. All right. It's time to throw some rocks. But rocks can't hurt machines, right? No, but they can distract them, draw them into traps. Like that watcher over there. It must be dealt with, or it will warn the herd and send them running before we get in range. Warn them? How? The machines speak to each other, Aloy. Unless they are first silenced. Now you stay here on the ridge. On my signal, throw rocks and draw the watcher over to me. Wait for my signal. There. Come, girl, it's safe now. Uh. Harvest the kill so I can teach you how to make arrows. Use the stalks as arrow shafts and metal shards for arrowheads. Good. You'll never run out of arrows if you know how to craft what you need. Let's put those arrows to use. Follow. Here. Stay low on the grass and be quiet. It's time to make your first kill, Aloy. A strider. One of the weaker machines. But even a weak machine can kill a hunter, if she's careless. You must study your prey. Its hide is thick, but there are spots where it is vulnerable. Like its eye. Can you guess another? The canister on its back. Is that a weakness? Yes. How did you guess that? The device. It showed me. But that plaything? Stop playing games. Hit! Put down that strider. Target the eye. You did well today. But you have much to learn. Tomorrow, we train again. What was that? That boy. The one running the brave trails. Follow Eloy, quick! I can do nothing. It's only a matter of time before the machines find that boy and kick him to death. But if I shoot... It will cause a stampede, and it will trample him. But I can see the path they take. Stop telling stories. I'm not. I can sneak through. You will not.
we should do this slowly and quietly. Let them see me. to see their path. Almost there. There he is. Hey! What? How is this? Follow me. Wait. Oh, Mother, bless that girl. B bless you both. She, Boy! She saved me. I, I just wanted... Boy! Seal your lips! They are outcasts, both. And she is motherless. Come now. Back to Mother's heart. should not have spoken to us. It's against tribal law. We'll go home now. Follow. I know the way. Mother. Stop. 
You're bleeding. Let me have a look. Here, hold still. I'll get it. Why? Shh. Why am I an outcast? Aloy, this is not the time. Who was my mother? Aloy, I've told you before, that's not for us to know. You were just a newborn when the matriarchs brought you to me. So the matriarchs, they know? It's not so simple. But they know. Aloy, we are outcasts. So how do I make them tell me? The matriarchs? There is a way, perhaps. So tell me. It would be dangerous. How? It would take years of training. I don't care. How do I do it? Tell me. The proving. The tribe's rite of passage held every year. Those who pass become braves. But to the one who wins, the matriarchs grant a boon. A boon? Yes, whatever the winner wants. Then I'll do it. <laughs> whatever it takes. I'll win the proving. I see. We'd best get started then. Your training will be hard. And it'll take years. Start training? Yes. Follow. Rost? 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 Where is he? Two days before the proving and he goes off without me? He wouldn't do that. He said we'd go hunting this morning. Why isn't he here? Where's he gone to? What's he doing up there?
He's just standing there. What's going on with him? Aloy, you're here. Did you want to be alone? No. We must speak. I've been thinking about your training, Aloy. You've learned to hunt, learned to survive. But I fear there's a lesson I failed to teach you. Would you learn it now? Of course. I'll always learn what you have to teach. There has been some trouble recently. It affords an opportunity to learn this lesson, but it will be dangerous. You must come prepared, or you will die. Descend into the embrace, and hunt until you have gathered the parts for fire arrows. Fire arrows? What kind of trouble are we talking about? Once you have the parts, you will meet me there, at the gate beyond the village of Mother's Heart. Uh, the North Gate? At the edge of the embrace? Yes. Now be on your way. Anything else you want me to do while I'm down in the embrace? Oh... Uh, Odd Grotta might be out of food by now. You could hunt a week's worth of meat for her, if you find the time. <sighs> Wouldn't mind, if she'd say thanks just once. <sighs> Grotta follows the law. Her science towards us is honorable, not an insult. If you say so. Is something else bothering you? No, I'm fine. Are you worrying about what happens after the proving? What happens is clear. You will be accepted as one of the tribe, and I will still be an outcast. To be shunned. Rost, even if the tribe accepts me, I won't- There is much to do, Aloy. We will discuss this later. <sighs> okay. I'll go gather the parts, but I'm also gonna pay Karst a visit. Aloy. That man breaks the law every time he speaks to you. And I'm glad he does. I want to buy a trip caster, and no other trader will sell to outcasts. Stock it with ammunition, then. You'll find use for that weapon tonight. That sounds ominous. All right, see you at the North Gate. Something's really bothering him. If he thinks I'm gonna abandon him, he's wrong. beyond this valley. That'll change after the proving. Two days. Two days until I get answers. Two days and I'll know who she was and why I was cast out at birth. As if there could be an excuse for that. All right, time to gather the parts for some fire arrows. I should find a herd. Mother's heart. Two more days and I'll know what it's like in there. It's so many people crammed into one place. I guess no one ever gets lonely in there. Bring that up later. Sorry. 
Just stay out of their way for now. Definitely not scrap. This old place. I haven't been here in years. Wonder what I can find. That area back there. I wonder if I can find a way into it now that I'm older. Some kind of power cell. I wonder what it's for.
головой. Time to see Karst and get a tripcaster. No one else around. Looks safe to meet. My guess is he'll be waiting. There he is. Looks nervous. Well, well, well. An outcast on my doorstep. All mother protect me. Surprised you saw me the way you keep looking every other direction to make sure no one's watching. Careful there, or you'll sprain your neck. It's always a pain in the neck when you show up, girl, one way or another. <laughs> Last time I visited, you had a tripcaster available for trade. Still got it? I do. But you'd need to bring me a scrapper lens. What can I say? Special weapons don't come cheap. Oh, I can pay. Took down a scrapper not long ago. Stripped out the lens in perfect condition. I'll be the judge of that. Show me. Now that you've got yourself a trip, my life's exciting and- Really? <laughs> Always a pleasure doing business. Will you be around later, in case I want to make another trade? I'll be here. Same as usual, bring me the parts you harvest from any machines you hunt. The better the parts, the more shards I'll pay. Be sure to take a close look at my inventory, though. Who knows? Maybe I've got something that could give you an edge in the proving. I guess that concludes our business. All right. See you around. I've got what I need. Time to meet Rost at the North Gate.
Yep, it's the motherless outcast again. Right stare. No, I think about it. We probably just got it anyway. She loves me. I know she does. Explosions and shouts from outside the embrace. I wonder what's going on. Aloy. You're here. of all days. I have to keep my mind on the proofing. You will turn back, outcast. Or bleed. Your choice. Make way! Make way! Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. I assure you, most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> Who else would I be? Come on now. I've been waiting for this day a long time. You have? Oh, yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja. Come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja? But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect. What is going on? Aloy! No. It's you, isn't it? It is Aloy, isn't it? I'm remembering your name correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? I don't know you. <laughs> I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hope to see you again. If you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead. A maker of garments and armor. In preparation for this day, I've made an outfit for you. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. Seems to fit you perfectly. Uh, thank you, Tab. I've never had anything like this before. Well, it's yours. I think you'll find it affords more protection than what you were wearing. Every outfit offers some advantage. It's always a trade-off. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. 
Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. Dog, get down from there. Bad enough, you're drunk. Listen Why do you have to go climbing now, houses? But not for you. will have to tell this when I'm not supposed to go climbing our other people. Aloy, over here. Karst, what are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? And how generous of you to talk to me now. Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the Proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks on some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last-minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. See you later, Karst. Good luck. In a moment, we shall bless the Proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. Peace is peace. <clears throat> An annunciation of gratitude written Killers by the slavers. hand of yeah. Sun King yeah. of Avon. Killers and slavers! Hey, hey, Luminance hold your fruit, nor, uh, nor a faithful. Hold your fruit. Now, I'm Azaram, not Karja, so I'll put it to you straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bung. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster. He raided my tribe for blood sacrifice, just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karja. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. And who killed him? The 14th. Yeah. Not because he, he lusted for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah! yeah. The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th King. So please, can't you lend him your ears? Hey, thank you. <clears throat> an enunciation of gratitude written by the hand of Sun King Avad, 14th luminance of the Radiant Line. <clears throat> It's for the goddess to judge the card did not need. Unknown to the past should be left in the past. What does that mean? No, He's wearing a focus. Just like it's mine. The goddess to judge. You're the only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? A Nora? Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places. Forbids them. Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, uh, I guess you're not. If you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. What's wrong? Apologies. Uh, a malfunction. Oh, Lynn? You making friends with locals, are we? I'll... I'll come back. Wait. No. Uh, we'll talk later. Have to go. Whoa. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey. You got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense, it looks great on you. I've never seen armor like yours before. You've never seen Vanguard steel? Well, let me introduce you. 
Ring locked, impact protected, sturdy enough to choke a sawtooth. It has to be. The vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life takers and machine breakers to a one. I might even give a Nora war maid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say. From where I'm standing, looks like a pretty even match. I should make my way to the Blessing. Yeah. Look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but... It's obvious that you don't belong in this backwater. I mean, you're smart. You're obviously capable, and... Well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what. All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'll be a whole new life, if you want it. I'll even introduce you to my sister. She's got more connections than I do. I thought you said she was captured and killed by the last Sun King. Ha! Captured, yes. Killed, no. It takes more than a few cards to finish Ursa. She got away. Now she's captain of the entire Vanguard. That's quite a story. Maybe I'll tell it to you sometime over a drink. Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? Start the blessing when all aspirants are in place. Aloy, take your place right there. The prayer lantern is yours. I made it for you. <laughs> Blasphemy, sisters. Aspirants, before each of you sits a prayer lantern crafted by your mother in her honor light its flame in honor of rost and all he did to help me get here all mother hear our prayer what is the child but a mother's hope that takes flight? A glowing flame that climbs the air, set free to the wind, sailing the sky till it fades and falls. So, from one to another, passes the chain of love. There's Olin. I have some questions for him. Musician didn't come back this year. Hello, Olin. You know my name. Ah, guess Aaron told you. Why did you act so strange when we spoke earlier? Must be this festival. I'm really not one for crowds. Maybe I should just turn in. Stop dodging my questions. All right, cool your fire. I got nothing to hide. I've never seen anyone else with a focus. Where exactly did you find it? In a ruin, north of the Claim. That's our name for the Asaram homeland. Up there, the metal seams run deep. Steel giants half buried in loose soil. Forgotten caves that the old ones bored into mountain rock. Your eyes just lit up. I found my focus in a cave just like you're describing. A ruin of the old ones. If you've dealt yourself, you know as much as I do. Go to those places for answers. Not me. When we spoke earlier, you winced, then looked like you were in pain. Or frightened. Did your focus show you something? It didn't show me anything. I told you. It malfunctioned. Happens all the time. Mine's never malfunctioned, and I've had it since I was a child. So yours is in better shape, then? I'm sure the land here is full of relics. Seeing how you Nora are too scared to delve the ruins. Because they think ruins are cursed. But I never said I think that. 
the North acknowledges a curse, I'm inclined to agree. What are you doing here, Olin? Why come to Noraland? Aaron needed a scout for his expedition, and a second for his drinking. That's all. Someone to stop the Sun Priest getting lost. When all this is over, I'm back to delving ruins, rummaging for scrap, scrounging up trinkets to sell. So you're an explorer? Just another Outlander, girl. A man's gotta make his shards. I just make mine in service to the King's court. That's all. I don't understand. We have this device in common, but you can't wait to stop talking to me. <sighs> I already have all the friends I need, girl. I don't need the bother. I'm used to being shunned by the tribe. I thought you'd be different. It's nothing personal. It really isn't. You should... Try to enjoy yourself tonight. Big day tomorrow. Always best to make every day count. <sighs> She's strong. What of a war chief in her? Oh, I love this part. Another less chuff. What did you say? Find your bed, outcast, and dream of winning the Proving. That's the closest you're gonna get. Oh, this is the bed house? With you standing guard, I figured it was the latrine. You're... you're very present here! <sighs> Look who's come in from the wild, the motherless outcast. <laughs> I see you've still got a scar from where that rock I threw hit you. Now that's a cherished memory. You can be a real lard sometimes, boss. Cut it out. You didn't- Aw, you even try to dress like a real Nora. Not that it fools anyone. So this is how it's gonna be with you, is it? This is how it's gonna be with everyone, outcast. You belong in the wilds, not Mother's heart. And you definitely don't belong in the Proving. The only way you know how to feel strong is to make someone else feel weak. It's not working. <laughs> I've trained all my life. You'll see tomorrow how strong I am. Oh, I've seen plenty. You grew a man's body, kind of. But down deep, you're still a scrawny little brat. You know, I often think of the day I gave you that scar. It's a cherished memory. What I remember is how the other children saw that you were a monster. But I suppose you leave that part of the story out when you tell it, don't you? I branded you that day to mark your shame. All you did that day was make me stronger. Just wait. I'll show you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, right. This is boring. Time for Boss to get some sleep. You'll be the one surprised tomorrow, outcast. Not me. Oh, are you gonna shut your mouth? Because that would be a surprise. Nice job handling Bost. That should keep him quiet. Till morning, anyway. I don't believe we've met. I'm Aloy. Oh, I know who you are. The competition. The others, they'll finish the proving. Most of them. But win it? That's down to Bost, you, or me. Vala. Nice to meet you, Vala. You're right. I am going to win tomorrow. Never celebrate a victory before it's earned, girl. My mother taught me that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna get some sleep. I plan to be well rested when I run you into the ground tomorrow. <laughs> Your bunk's right there when you want it. Okay. Thanks. So? Your first day in Mother's Heart. What do you think? You've never slept in a Nora Lodge before. Not very private. It has... certain charms. Homey enough, once you're accepted. That's the problem. 
I think you'll find a place here. I do. Get some rest. Ready yourselves! What will it take to get you out of here? Razor! <laughs> Your trophy is shattered, outcast. Looks like you'll need another. Dead last, girl. Might as well walk from here. Boss will win, Urvala. But you'll be made a brave so long as you finish. Oh, now. That's an old trail. Two died on it last year. It's falling apart. Better dead last than dead altogether. Whoa, 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 whoa! My old mother, are you crazy? You're gonna kill yourself! It doesn't get any easier! You're insane to go that way! That's it. No way but forward Just now. Stop right there. Just turn around. Who's in the lead? I can't see! Fox will follow that behind. Come on now. Faster. Stop dragging. Gotta keep going. The outcast. On the old trail? Is she crazy? Good. I'm gaining. Look. The outcast is catching up. How'd she get up there? I made it. Come on now. Hurry. Keep at it.
Armand, you can make it. Can't let them beat me now. She didn't win. The outcast cheated. An outcast win the proving? Never. For she is a brave now. You did it. As are you all. So long as you put your trophy on the altar. But it is Aloy. Once outcast, and now brave, who is first among you. Ah! Till the others arrive. We can't stay here. That's the way out. But we won't make it under fire. They, they can't shoot if they're dead. Keep them busy. I'll find an angle. Fast! Fast! Are you with us? I'm with you! Let's go. Now! We can't win! Quick! Run for the Smith wire! Kill them all! No witnesses, no survivors! Goodbye, quiet approach. Oh no! There's more! They keep coming! Don't run out. How many now. are there? Fight! Watch out! There's more of them! Yeah. You will not escape their shadow. <laughs> Too many of them! Now, descend while we have a chance. Dies now! Everyone! Forward!
you command. Dying. <gasps> to catch her there is blasphemy. She should be near her mother. must have found me before I bled out. But why is no one here? Where am I? <sighs> my clothes. Good. But where's my focus? Jerks are allowed inside. I... I don't see my bow here. Or the damaged focus, the one I took off the... Killer. I'm picking up some kind of signal.
looks like the ruins I fell into when I was young. Another one of these power cells. But what do I do with it? But Nora didn't build this place. The old ones did. But why? There. With the rest of my things. Commanders, halt excavations and proceed at once to the mission point. Avoid all contact with Nora savages. But if you are seen, kill every witness. Target imaging attached. Do not fail. Target imaging. Who says I'm like other Nora? Focus. How is that possible? Then make it quick. I'm heading in. Hold for identity scan. You need to stop listening to Ted and start listening to me. Where's this from? And when? You, my mother. Why try to kill me just because I look like you? Aloy, you are awake. You brought me here? Quickly, you must follow. To where? To the place where you were born. Are you saying I was born here, inside the mountain? It is easier if I show you. Why did you bring me here? It seemed you were dying, and to die near one's mother is sacred. Lanthra fought it, of course, but Jezza sided with me. Is my mother here? Am I going to meet her? It's complicated. Please, just follow me. Does my mother look like me, but with short hair? I don't see how that could be. You were not born of a woman, Aloy. The mountain is your mother. I'm... What? What are you talking about? Come. What is this place? The Great Chamber, where all mother slew the Metal Devil and gave birth to you. Aloy, the Proving Massacre was just the first of many disasters. The war party we sent after the killers was ambushed and slaughtered. But what does that have to do with where I was born? My hope is... everything. This is where we found you. We heard your cries, came to look, and there you were. Just... 
Just flying there? Yes. You mean I came from behind the door? Always, that is what I have believed. That you came from the womb of the mountain. A gift from all mother herself. But others, like Lanzra, feared that a darker power put you here. Not a gift, but a curse. But... this isn't a goddess. Aloy! It's a door. With people behind it. My mother? <gasps> oh. Oh. Hold for identiscan. The goddess speaks. Just like the woman I saw. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. Identity cannot be confirmed. Entry denied. No. No. Please. Aloy, all mother spoke to you, as if she knew you. Were you not listening? It didn't recognize me. Because of corruption, the goddess's own words. Surely, if you heal this corruption, she will see you clearly. And how would I do that? You said you've had visions. Of a woman with short hair. The killers came for me. Because I look like her. But their power is overwhelming. Is there no other trail to follow? Owen. He was one of the outsiders. The night before the proving. The killer saw me through his eyes. He lives in Meridian. So you will have to leave the sacred land. I've been an outcast all my life. Why not an exile too? Shh. There is another way. Come, and we will make it so. You said the tribe was on the brink of extinction. What happened? After the massacre at the Proving, a great war party was sent after the killers. Less than half survived. Uh, how was the war party defeated? The killers do not fight alone. Somehow they have a power over the machines, corrupting them, driving them mad. So the killers got away? Yes. And now the only plan my sister matriarchs can agree to is to sing the hymn of atonement and beg for all mother's mercy. As though she would not want us to help ourselves. Then, what's your plan? This. This was my plan. To show you where you were born and loose you to follow the destiny all mother intended for you. The other high matriarchs are waiting for us. Let me do the talking. It is done? Yes. I showed her. Sisters, the goddess spoke to Aloy, told her to heal the corruption. Ha! But how is she to do that? She will have to journey beyond our sacred land. A seeker? If the goddess spoke, it must be so. You would name this thing a seeker? Sister! For once, Lanzra, join with us. This will be your sin, not mine. Send her seeking, and may she never be seen again. Aloy, by the holy grace of the One Goddess, we hereby anoint you a Seeker of the Nora tribe. No barrier can now stay you from your sacred task. May All Mother protect you and sustain you. 
stay true. I will make ready for the hymn. Our hopes lie with you. Tirsa, what's a seeker? You are. And here is your mark. In times of great need, the High Matriarchs may anoint a seeker. A worthy brave sent forth to accomplish a great purpose. No matter where that purpose might take her. Even beyond the borders of the sacred land? Yes. And with the right to return when you are done, or as the need arises. I should be on my way. From here, you must go to the gates of the Embrace. Speak to Varro, and he will point the way to Meridian. If any Nora tries to stand in your way, Aloy, make sure they know you are a seeker. Oh, I will. Thank you, Tirsa, for all you've done. May all Mother bless you and watch over you. Nora Faithful, we will soon begin. Purify your hearts. Soon we will beg forgiveness for the sins that brought such misery on The outcast girl. So she survived her wounds. She saved many lives. The tribe is lucky to have her. Aloy! Ah, uh, the outcast. Aloy! Ignore her. Continue the report. There are rumors of a demon loot. I need the gate opened. <laughs> Since when has any outcast's need been my concern? Since I was anointed a seeker. Now open the gate. You? A seeker? Have Tissa and Jezza gone insane? Bad enough that they let you run in the proving. But to nurse you back to health inside the sacred mountain? No wonder a curse is upon us and children lie dead under cairns of stone. How can you be so heartless? I fought beside those children, shoulder to shoulder and back to back. I saw them fall. If even one of them had been true, Nora, they would have put an arrow in your back. Resh, come on. Silence! I am your war chief. And I am a seeker anointed by the High Matriarchs. So open the gate, and I will be on my way. The sooner you're gone from here, the better. What was that? What's it doing to them? Taking control. Brace yourselves! What have you brought on us now, you motherless curse? Kill them, Brace! Kill them all! Get in position. Here it comes. Attack! Watch the striders! It's driven them mad! It's down! The 
Demon is dead! Merged with the killers at the proving. How does it possess other machines? How'd you do it? Show me. <laughs> you made them obey you. But how? This. You did it with this. It's connecting to my focus. Then I could use this. It's worth a shot. Couple loops of wire. Looks like it'll hold. I just need to test it. Aloy! How did you do that? Tev? What are you doing here? You're a stitcher, not a brave. I came to help defend Mother's Watch. But I never imagined I'd see anything like this. You killed that demon. Pulled its guts from the carcass. The way it controls other machines. I think I figured it out. But I need to test it on a machine. Uh, plenty of striders along the path to the gates of the Embrace, I guess. Exactly. And the gates are where I'll be headed anyway. I need to speak to Varl. I always knew you were different, Aloy, but... But... What? I think you're a blessing from all mother. No matter what Ress says. <laughs> Thank you, Teb. But I have to go now. I know you do. And my thoughts go with you. How could the car jump? Raid! I want that gate repaired immediately! I need to find a machine and see what this device can do. I can test the override device on them. Should go in quiet. Didn't go through all nice and quiet. Okay, here it goes. Come on, come on. It worked. There we go. That a yeah. It's walking. I should try overriding other kinds of machines. Probably can't ride them all, but I might find a use for them. Watch yourselves! Okay, Bring it closer! Closer! Varl, I take it? Am I seeing things? Or were you riding that strider when you came through the gate? Uh, I was. It's hard to explain. I imagine so. Strange times we live in. We who've survived. I recognize you, of course. Aloy, the outcast who won the proving. I'm glad to see you survived your wounds. High Matriarch Tirsa said you might know the way to Meridian. The capital of the Karja Sundom? You seek exile? No. A traitor named Olin. The matriarchs made me a seeker so I could go after him. Huh. Well, then you should head north to Mother's Crown. If you make it, talk to Morea. She'll point the way. If I make it? The trail is dangerous. Ever since the War Party Massacre, our lands go unpatrolled and our borders unguarded. 
We have no war chief to lead us. Isn't that Resh's job? Ugh. Only because Sona went missing. I'd go after her myself, but she ordered me to hold this gate with my life. And so I have. I should be on my way. Aloy, before you make the journey to Mother's Crown and beyond, is there any chance you could search for Sona? The tribe needs her leadership. I'd go after her myself if she hadn't commanded me to hold this gate at all costs. Where was she last seen? The War Party Massacre site. A wooded hollow across from Devil's Thirst, on this side of the river. You might be able to pick up her trail there. She went after the killers who attacked the Proving, who killed those we love, who tried to kill you, and... I... I get it, Varl. I'll see what I can do. God is protected. My whole life, all of it me and right. The world just got bigger. But also more dangerous. Focus is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. down here. seen one of these since all these devices are missing power cells. I'll have to find power cells to get these to work. There, fits. I just need to slot in these two. It's some kind of code. Maybe there's a clue. Maybe there's some more information nearby. Something that will tell me how this works.
like each dial has four positions. Maybe if I get each dip. Now to check the door. Those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. I can always use these. Just need to install these power cells. That should do it. Only two more. Just one more. There we go, the last one. All powered up. Now to get the dials in position. There must be some kind of code. Did it. Let's have a look at that armor inside. Those clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to... Just need to install these power cells. That should do it. flowers and why I'm 
Chief Sona went after the killers from the prison. Maybe I should try to find her. They made her a seeker. Feed her, Come here, girl. Let's have the girl with the mark of a seeker. The sentinel saw you coming. You're Maria. Varl told me you'd know the way to Meridian. The Karja capital. West will take you to it. But their soldiers will stop you long before you get there. They can try. No, what I mean is there's a Karja fort that guards the pass between East and West. Word is, the Karja have sealed the gate out of fear of the corrupted machines infesting our sacred land. So if I clear out the corrupted machines, they'll open the border? I suppose. But I can't spare any braves to help you. Who said I needed help? You'll clear the valley, all by yourself. I'm good with a bow. For your sake? Better than good, I hope. I should be going. All right. Be careful out there, Aloy. I hope you find whatever it is you're after. I haven't slept in days with my sister's twins TV. Those machines. I can see the corruption coming off them like smoke. Time to clear them out. This poison seems almost to eat away at metal. Maybe that's what drives the machines mad. Might find a way to use it someday. Like that machine carries three of these things. I'm not sure I want to find out what kind. Just stay out of their way for now.
Low and quiet does it. Fascinating. They weren't looking for me. Thing with this. Getting through here.
Good. Another power cell. If I find more, I should be able to get to that ancient armor I found. I know I mail you too much. I'm just proud of what you're doing. Everyone back home is. We got moved inland 10 kilometers, just as a precaution, they say. School's still in session, so I get to keep my eye on Andrews and Reggie. We never know where or when you're fighting, but when the VTOLs go over, all the kids run out and wave. I believe in you. I know nothing's ever going to be the same, but I believe in you.
Looking good. override that machine. But if I could learn more about it. Here they come, corrupted watchers. I've done what 
I can to cleanse this valley of corruption. Time to see if the Karja Fort will let me pass over the mountains. This day. It wasn't the sun risking its ass down here. So, will you open the gate for me now? <laughs> you heard her. Open the gates and send word to Captain Balan. Where are you headed, girl? West to Meridian. The way of broken stones is a hard run, even in the best of times. You might want to have a word with Captain Balan. He came from Meridian not long ago. You find him in the fort, on a balcony to the left overlooking the valley. Okay, thanks. We're the ones who should be thanking you for taking down those machines. Walk in light, Nora. Sun. Words to live. Won't cost you a shard just to look. Everything he knows. Who the killers were, how they saw me through his focus. Who the woman is. One who looks like me. Why they want me dead. Olin's trail leads to Meridian. When I catch him, he will talk. Then he will pay for all the lives he's ruined.
sends into it. place in the order of things. Shouldn't ride this machine into a settlement. I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What uh, am I supposed no, to I'm do? Awake. Just Animal sit alert. here and let everything <sighs> spoil? Damn it. I thought the radium was open to all the cards. What's going what on here? Balloons in there. Somewhere. And so is Aaron, that other outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Aaron said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain work. of the Vanguard. City's locked down on account of the murder. If this keeps up, I'll be broken a month. Getting through, it's outlander. always the merchants who suffer. Hold! Stop right there. In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were... Dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So, you're alive! This, uh, we should celebrate! It drinks on me! We need to talk, alone, and you need to pull together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There, alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. And some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. And now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. I 
I, uh... I lost someone, too. At the Proving. The man who raised me. His name was Rost. That's terrible. But why is it every time something terrible happens? Everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, so that makes it easier. Yeah, why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? I need to find Olin. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Olin is working with them. But... <laughs> I mean, this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Uh, come on. So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. Only the finest goods here. Keep for yourself. That girl. Is she... Anymore. Apparently they're letting anyone into the city these days. Check out these words. How long will his blood hide in his palace? Blood for blood. Vengeance for Ursa. How long will Avad hide in his palace? Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Aaron, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Not now. Okay, how are we gonna get in? <laughs> oh, that was subtle. Here we are. Try not to break anything. That other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. See what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it? Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. Call it a day, girl. You're wasting time. Looks big and heavy. Let's give it a little push. I did say not to break anything, didn't I?
serve and they live. Disobey, and I will open their throats and leave their corpses to prune in the sun. They took his wife and child captive. They? Who's they? The killers. They told him to obey or they'd kill his family. The map. The glyphs show places he visited. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me and the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus, it's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances, and see through each other's focuses too, like looking through each other's eyes. So that's how the killers saw you, through Olin. Yes, so far as I can tell. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that, but the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Look, I'll head for Red Ridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Red Ridge Pass, you said? I'll see what I can do. I promise. These aren't goods. They're necessity. Always stay bright. Always stay awake. That's what I say.
costs. Got no stomach for killing other Kardra. These will keep. Easier when I was a kid. You gotta shoot a tiny jig under a dock with some shade to get some of those lazy fish. This pole may not look like much, but I caught a 
beauty with it just last week. She went that away. My focus is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. My focus is picking up some kind of signal. Maybe I can scan it. The machine looks as fast as it is hard. Better be careful.
eclipse, just like he said. You died from a rat! The Eclipse and Corrupted Machines cooperating on Happy Family. This is it.
Who's going numb? Keep moving. Another power cell. I only need one more to get to that ancient world. <laughs>
Back to your business. like a sawtooth, but heavily armed. Ouch.
heavy. What's going on? Need to be somewhere else.
Watchers. What are they doing all the way up here? Machines are territorial here, but what am I intruding on? Somewhere I shouldn't have. But for this time, there's worse than the matriarchs to disapprove.
This should be the last power cell I need to get to that ancient armor I found. I'm <laughs> soaked from melted snow. Clamps have the armor locked in place. Maybe there's a way to power up the mechanism, release the clamps. Only two more. Just one more. There we go, the last one. All powered up. Now to get the dials in position. There must be some kind of code. <sighs> Did it. Let's have a look at that armor inside. All right, now let's see what we can do with this material. <laughs> 